We are back at 742 and we are ready to reveal the answer to the question we've been asking all week. Who will be Times Person of the Year? That's right. We had you weigh in. We batted around our ideas. Now the moment of truth. Nancy Gibbs is the editor of Time. Nancy, welcome back. Good to have you here. You gave us the short list on Monday. Mm -hmm. Was it just an exercise? Had you made the decision already? Uh, yes, we did. Oh, thanks. We, That's <laughs> nice. Okay. We're just trying to build some suspense. Yeah, exactly. All right, good. We're just turning our wheels. All right, let's start with number five, and it's in, uh, Iran's president, Hassan Rouhani. Obviously, this has been a big year in terms big of the, the him, nuclear deal. Brokered the nuclear deal and really represents a gamble by the West that he represents a new political calculus in Iran. And by the way, these aren't from number of votes received or anything like this, just no. a list you created. At number four, you went with Black Lives Matters activists. This year, they really evolved from an organic protest movement to an organized national political movement. They drove police chiefs and college presidents from office. They're holding candidates to account. We've really seen a major change in the, the way they operate this year. All right, number three, I'm going to go out on a limb and say this is going to be a shocker because people thought that Donald Trump would be your person of the year. You put him at number three. Why? You know, uh, all year long, he has been saying things that were counted as disqualifying. I've lost count how many times. So here's the test. If he who breaks all the rules can live to play another day, then he writes the new rules. We're now going to find out. Uh, if he is as good at winning votes as he is at winning news cycles, then in the months to come, he may well position himself. We'll be here a year from now. In the history of Person of the Year, we've actually never named a presidential candidate as Person of the Year. Of course, I heard a lot from Bernie Sanders' people and Ben Carson's. And from his people. Actually, from, from him. He said, I say there's no way they give it to me. They can't because mentally they can't. They just can't. They can't do it. Even if I deserve it, they can't do it. Uh, if he thinks he deserves it, he has the whole next year to let the voters decide that. All right. Okay. At number two, this is the one I will tell you that our viewers thought would be the person of the year. Abu Bakr al-Baghdadi, the leader of ISIS, who this year went from building a regional power to building a transnational terrorist franchise. And the expansion of its ambitions and its operating theater poses a, such a significant challenge. And what kind of a, of a decision would it have been for Time magazine to name him person of the year? Would, would it have been impossible? It, nothing's impossible. We have named great villains in the past. Adolf Hitler was person of the year. Um, but in his case, it also is worth bearing in mind that in many ways, this is a year in which he has lost ground, literally. And, and his power is partly an opportunism. He did not invent Middle East anarchy. He did not invent the Internet. He has just uh, taken great advantage of both of them. Didn't invent terror either. Let's do number one. Drum roll, please. It's Chancellor Angela Merkel. Chancellor Angela Merkel is our 2015 Person of the Year. And in a year where world leaders were tested all through the year, no one was tested the way she was. Over and over again, the threat to European peace and security really fell to her. First the economic crisis this summer, the refugee crisis this fall, now the return of terrorism in Europe. And she has stepped up in a way that was uncharacteristic even for her. She's been a very long-serving leader, the longest serving in the West. She controls the world's fourth largest economy. But this year she really was tested in how she would respond to some of the most difficult challenges that any leader is facing in the world. So Angela Merkel. Times person of the year. They're telling me Donald Trump's on line two. He wants to <laughs> Nancy Gibbs. By the As way, only the fourth woman yeah. to have a solo cover. Uh, and I expect that is likely to be changing in years to come as well. Thanks for always doing this with us. We enjoy it. We really do, Nancy. Congrats. The person of the year issue hits newsstands on Friday. Hello today, fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.